Hey, wait up. Whew. All right, so just got back from the conference, you know, and uh, they were talking about how, you know, this is the best way to sell knives. So I'm like, well, you know, I've never really sold And she keeps telling me that she doesn't want to go to the playground with me. It's not fun at all for her, and I love it. So. So a liberal arts major is completely useless to you, dude. I mean, you'd never be able to get a decent job with that. I'm so concerned about it, man. You really got to stop doing that. Because if you got caught, you know, you go to prison, and you're just you're too pretty for prison. You, 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 They'd be all over you like a banshee on a biscuit. So, you know, my other nephew, he watched some movie and he got the, the phrase knuck and butts from it. And so he got on this kick. He kept saying knuck and butts, knuck and butts. So one time he's standing in the kitchen with his mom and he goes, that's knuck and butts. And she wasn't paying attention. She thought he really cussed. So she smacked him right across the mouth. And he starts crying and he goes like, what the fuck, bitch? So you take your tomatoes, right, and you kind of dice them up nice and small. Then you throw them down in there with the tomato paste, and you stir that up and let it simmer a little bit. So then you just grab your hand full of sugar and just... And Who the fuck are you? Grrrr! <laughs>